week two, sunny week two, time for a run. Sunny, a bit more refreshed. It's really humid, hot today, really sweaty, but it feels like a better day to run. So I'm enjoying this. Okay, so I've just reached the halfway point. I feel a lot better than I did when I first started doing these runs. I was usually quite tired after the first couple of sort of running sections, and at that point they were only sort of one minute long, with a longer pause in between. Um, I'm feeling good. I was looking up there. Uh, what was it? Ah, oh, what was that looking for? That was it. I was looking at um, See You Real Soon. Did a Disney virtual run. Uh, really interesting. I'm trying to look up about it. I emailed them and they said you can do it internationally, so I'd love to get one of the medals. Is it here? So. Right, next run coming up. Okay, last run coming up. And I'm feeling good. Right, and that was my run today. Nice sunny day, feel a lot better. I'll give me a bit more feedback in a minute when I get in. Less sweaty. Um, right, I just wanted to explain what happened after that uh, run. I came back, sat down for about four or five minutes and uh, got a phone call, had some pretty bad sort of personal family news, so I didn't get to really speak after that run. Um, but it, it went really well, it was a good run, in, it was nice in the uh, sunshine, which shaved out the news afterwards, but the actual run itself was really good, I felt really good after it. Um, I didn't have any sort of aches and pains the next day which I have been having so I'm, I've started to lose that now I've been doing it more often which is uh, really nice to have. Uh, it means I can sort of run a bit more and a bit further than maybe the app says and it doesn't feel so bad afterwards. Uh, next part I'm going to go and talk about is what I got for my birthday around my birthday time so there are some Disney things and just personal things people may have bought me or I've purchased myself over the last sort of few weeks so I'll go through those now. Right, I'm going to start with Disney things. The first one I'm going to show you is my socks. Now, I've mentioned these in a couple, no, I think in one video, my last video, and I will show you on Instagram. They're my uh, sort of white sports socks, but they've all got different coloured Mickey Mouse uh, logos on them. These are currently on sale on the ASOS website. They're about uh, £8, I think, for five pairs, and each one has a different colour. I think there's yellow, black, green, red and blue and they're really comfortable. I wear them every time I run uh, for playing basketball and it's really enjoy wearing those actually. Uh, right, next second Disney thing. I purchased this. Uh, this is going to go on the desk behind me. This isn't to play with or anything. Uh, but a Toy Story Slinky Dog. I saw it in uh, TK Maxx, uh, in TJ Maxx in America and you can see it wasn't, wasn't very expensive. As you can see there, I've got a focus. It was a uh, four ninety nine, so it wasn't expensive. That's which I think what that is in dollars. That's five pounds, about eight dollars. So I'm just gonna. I'm gonna. I'm not sure yet if I'm gonna take out the package or not, but I'm gonna keep it on the desk behind me, so it looks like the original one from the film. And I just, I don't know. I saw it and I had to buy it. I don't know why. It was a sort of an impulse buy, but one I really am happy about. Uh, I got a lot of the Finding Dory Zum Zum, so I'll hold up a couple of those. I'll just hold up a couple of them. Uh, so I think it's uh, Hank, isn't it? The uh, octopus, and of course Dory, the tail fins. I also got Nemo, his dad, and a couple of others. Only a couple I'm missing. Uh, not quite sure what they were off the top of my head. I think one is the teacher from the school, and the grey. I think it's a whale. I don't actually know. I can't. I can't remember from the trailer for the film. Uh, I'll put a picture of the two I'm missing here, so you can know which ones I'm talking about. But whilst I got those in the Disney store, they were selling uh, these bottles uh, for three ninety nine. if you spent over £10. So I got a couple of these. I got this one to match my Donald one with Mickey. And I also got another Mickey Mouse one, red one, which just has his face. 
uh, which I used for a smoothie which is coming up in this video in a little bit. Uh, Trying to think, did I get anything else Disney? Oh, I had this as a present. My parents came back from holiday and brought me this. It's a tube of uh, Smarties in a retro edition, but it has a Mickey Mouse on top. A little Mickey Mouse figurine on top for my girlfriend. They bought her the same one, but with a Minnie Mouse on top. So at the end, we could maybe take them off and have them standing somewhere in our future home. Uh, other Disney things. Uh, I got a few t-shirts from uh, Uniqlo from my girlfriend for my birthday, which were Disney related, a couple of them. Um, I have worn these and I've literally just pulled them out of the wash basket. I haven't washed them yet, so apologies for the wrinkles, so I'll show you a couple of them. Uh, first one I've got is a Toy Story t-shirt. So it's uh, covered in sort of toy soldiers and the Toy Story logo is sort of dotted throughout and it says uh, Toy Story. So I'm hoping to wear this to uh, Hollywood Studios this summer. So you'll see that possibly in my videos upcoming. Uh, I'll put the prices down here somewhere if I know what they are. I mean, some of these weren't bought by me, so I'm not too sure. And the other Disney one, if I can find it, is here. It's uh, Mickey Mouse, but it's sort of two-toned. So it's white on the top, black on the bottom, and the uh, image changes to match the opposite colour of the part of the shirt. So that was, a. I think they were pretty much the same price. I, I think they were roughly around 7 99 but I can't say that for sure. So if I'm wrong, I'll put them here, but I, they might not be on sale anymore. They're from sort of a couple of months ago. They were purchased, so I'm not too sure. Uh, my other Disney things, I got this pair of socks. I bought this pair of socks. They're only uh, one ninety nine from H&M. I got some Mickey Mouse on them, so I'll probably wear those on holiday. I probably might do an outfit video, even though I'm a guy, I'll do outfits for each park. And I'll show you those. And the other thing I got, which I was really excited, I really wanted this. I hope to use this this summer. The point is the it's a uh, picture with uh, tumblers inside. See if I can get some of the tumblers out. This is also from the Disney store. This was a present, birthday present for my girlfriend. So I do know the price because it, it's, it's on the Disney store every it's and the price is on it. It was twelve ninety five, so thirteen pounds, and it comes with little plastic tumblers with a uh, crown outside, little Mickey head, and it's just sort of a nice little um, nice little um, jug picture with Mickey Mouse on the outside to match sort of colours match. I really wanted this as soon as I saw it, and. My, my girlfriend told me not to buy it because she'd get it for my birthday, which she did, so I'm really happy I got that. Uh, I think that's it for Disney things. If I find anything else, I'll add it in at the end. But I'll go through the other things that people bought me now. So, I also got, uh, as well as the cookie cutters you saw me using my biscuit video, I got a, a silicone tray that we use for ice cubes or for chocolates. And it is of dinosaurs. I don't know if you can see those. So it's small little dinosaur chocolates or ice cubes. So you just pour the water in and leave it in the fridge. That was also from TK Maxx. I know the price of this. I was with her when she bought it. So she didn't take it off. It was uh, £2.49 or £2.50. Which is roughly around... Uh, I'd say just under $4. $4 I think. I'm not... Uh, my maths is really bad off the top of my head. But I'd say around $4. Uh, my parents as well as buy me that Mickey Mouse Smarties from when they went on holiday, they also bought me the official England football shirt or soccer shirt for if you're American. Um, I honestly thought they were going to get me sort of a fake rip off one from a stall, but they actually went to a store and got me the official Nike shirt which was something like $85, that's the authentic one. Yeah. Right. Hopefully this is at the right angle. I had to record the rest of my phone because my camera just died and I really need to record this before I go off and do some other stuff. But um, I also got these sort of little boxes of sort of sugar pill kind of sweets. There were sort of five different ones. So this one here is strawberry and lemon. But they were very much sort of sort of like sugar pills, sort of classic kind of little candy hard shell things, but they were really nice. And the last item I got, oh, they were also, sorry, but also these. Uh, little pink guava candies, sort of sprinkled in the bag, but they were they were really nice. And 
I got a bottle of, now I'm going to pronounce this wrong, I know I am, so please correct me. It's either Ramune, Ramune, or Ramune, and I don't, I never know which one, so please feel free to correct me in the comments. But, so this is just a carbonated soft drink, it's not one of the flavoured ones as far as I'm aware. But it has on it a picture of Goku from Dragon Ball Z, so I was really happy when I pulled this out of the bag, because I loved Dragon Ball Z as a sort of teenager, I used to draw all the pictures sort of around the age of sort of... 10 to sort of 14. I was really into Dragon Ball Z, so I was really happy when I saw this. I haven't drank it yet. I'm gonna put it in the fridge, really, really chill it. Have it probably on a weekend on a nice day.